What's up guys, in this video I am going to share one more interesting puzzle. Before getting into the details, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and enable notifications so that you will not miss any of my videos. Let me read the puzzle now for you. There are 100 people standing in a circle in an order 1 to 100. Number 1 as a sword. He kills the next person that is number 2 and gives the sword to the next that is number 3. All people do the same until only one survives. Which number survives at the last? So let me repeat the problem. There are 100 people starting from 1 to 100. One has a sword. He kills the next person that is number 2 and gives the sword to the next that is number 3. All people do the same until only one survives. You are supposed to identify which number survives at the last. Feel free to pause the video and try yourself before checking the solution. Let me solve this puzzle more logically. Consider the case where there are 2 to the power of n numbers in the circle. If the total number of people is 2 to the power of n, then each time the number reduces by half and the number 1 remains till the end. For example, if there are 32 people. In the first round, 16 people dies and remaining people will be 16. And in the second round, out of 16 people, 8 people dies and remaining people will be 8. And in the third round, out of 8 people, 4 people dies and remaining people will be 4. And in the fourth round, out of 4 people, 2 people dies and remaining people will be 2. And finally, in the final round, out of two people, one person dies and the person one is the remaining one. Here, the most important point to remember is, when there are two to the power of n numbers in the circle, each time the number reduces by off and the number one remains till the end. Now let's back to the actual problem. Here in this puzzle, there are 100 people. So the logic is to reduce the people to the number where the number is the power of 2. So in the given scenario, number 1 has a sword. He kills next person that is number 2 and gives sword to next to next that is number 3. First person kills the next. So starting from 1, we will remove next person that is 2. The first person gives word to next to next that is 3, that person will also kill next person and this continues. Means in circle we need to start with 1 and remove the every alternate person till 72. All the even people will be removed till 72 and we will be left with 64 people. It is because 1 kills 2, 3 kills 4 and so on till 71 kills 72. So 36 people have been killed till now since every alternate person is killed. Remaining people is 100 minus 36 which is 64. Now 64 people remain in the circle and the 64 is a power of 2. That is 2 to the power of 6 is 64. We know from the prior example that the case when there are 2 to the power of n numbers in the circle, each time the number reduces by half and the number 1 remains till the end. So here, in this case, the first guy after 72 will be new number 1 in a circle of 2 to the power of 6. So number 73 will survive. So understand this more logically. The logic is try to reduce the total number of people to the number where the number is power of 2. In this case, we are actually reducing to the number to 64 since 64 is a power of 2 that is 2 to the power of 6 which yields 64. So when the number reduces to 64, as per the prior example, the number 1 always survives. But here, 
we are already reached to the number 72nd so the immediate first number will be 73rd and the 73rd will be the first number when the people are standing in the circle when the number is reduces to the number which is power of 2 hence in this case the 73rd person will survive if you have not understood the logic watch it again like the video if it found useful for you share the video with your friends thanks for watching Let's meet in the next video with one more interesting puzzle. Thank you.